Hey, hello guys. I drank some beer yesterday, so I'm a little bit hungover. Not sure if I'm going to the range. <laughs> but I did find this. I'm gonna put my thumb over my name. It's... Uh, let's see if we can do that like this. Is it visible? Yeah. So this is a letter from the Justice Ombudsman in Sweden. When I nagged, as I do, about the police to them. Let's see what they have to say. I just found it. I, I joke and say that I, I can use these for wallpaper by now. It's, it's almost as if I could do that. So <coughs> what we tried to do in the shooting club was uh, move uh, one of the shooting club's firearms from one place to another, from one person to another. So, so the... the the new shooters in the club could get better access to the firearm for training. <clears throat> and we did that in August last year. Uh, I think it was last week when they actually made the change. And it, 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 I don't understand why it's taking so long. Because that's, like, that's just changing the address and, and a name in, in a database, basically. It's like five seconds of work. It should be. So let's see, I told the Justice Ombudsman about it, and let's see here, what they're saying. So, yeah. Let's remove the address here. Here you can see. And I'll translate this for anyone who doesn't understand Swedish. <coughs> uh, you have um, reported the police. Your report will not <laughs> uh, lead to anything from the Justice Ombudsman. Uh, yeah, basically that's it. In Swedish this is Du har anmält polismyndigheten. Din anmälan ger inte anledning till någon åtgärd från GIO-sida. Ärendet avslutas. That just means they don't give a shit. <coughs> and this is the usual uh, usual way they handle these issues. <laughs> and this is just a paper that explains how the Justice Ombudsman works. So what it basically says is you cannot appeal this decision. It's final. And yeah. So you get a paper that says we don't care. And <laughs> the police can do whatever the fuck they want. And then the police do just that. Uh, the Justice Ombudsman in Sweden is a joke. <clears throat> they, on paper they have small teeth that they actually can do something with. Take a little bite. Or you can at least say something to the government agency that you report for not doing their job or in this case actually breaking the law. But they never do anything. So before the Justice Ombudsman was... Uh, it was like an honorary job at the end of your career as a, as a lawyer or whatever. Uh, and those people really took their responsibility. This was a long time ago now. Mm. Nowadays, it's something uh, young people do at the beginning of their career. And they actually have like an informal decision. I've been told this by, by an attorney they actually, who, who knows these people personally. Uh, they actually have like an informal decision to never take any action because that could impact their future careers. And that's how it works in Sweden. <laughs> uh, yeah. So another fun thing. Uh, we have a law. Uh, we used to have a law, but the socialists removed it in the 70s. It's called tjänstemannansvaret. And that means that government uh, workers who, who take, uh, who manages people's lives basically, uh, has to be, be held accountable if they do anything stupid, like being corrupt or breaking the law or whatever, when they do their work. This was removed by the socialists with the explicit argument that the state can never do anything wrong. So last year, last spring, uh, the political party Moderaterna, or the moderates, or the not-so-left-leaning party, <laughs> I, I, w I won't call them right, they're not really. Uh, anyway, so they... Uh, put up a motion in parliament to say that you should investigate if we need to reinstate this law again. But the socialists are in government right now, so nothing has happened. 
So parliament is the one who tells the government what they should do, but the government doesn't give a shit. And it's been a year and they have still haven't even talked about it. <laughs> so nothing's gonna happen. And that's how it works in Sweden. Now you learn a bit more about Swedish politics. It doesn't work. Yeah, have a nice weekend. I'm gonna drink my coffee now. <laughs>